In Palestine, the Red Crescent Society launched on Sunday an urgent appeal to the international community to protect the population of the Gaza Strip after nine days of Israeli bombardment, which caused 2,450 deaths. The Palestine Red Crescent Society said that the population of that territory is alone while human rights are being violated. It also denounced the forced transfer orders issued by the Israeli army to 1.1 million people, including doctors and patients, and warned that the Al-Quds Hospital, located in Gaza City, is at risk of being bombed by Israeli planes. The death toll from Israel's relentless bombardment of Gaza has already reached 2,450, surpassing the total death toll of the 2014 war that lasted almost two months and was so far the bloodiest ever experienced in the enclave. The indiscriminate Israeli attacks have also left 9,200 wounded, according to the latest data from the health ministry in Gaza, which has described as ethnic cleansing the Israeli campaign unleashed by the surprise attack a week ago by Hamas. That brutal aggression left more than 1,400 people dead in Israel, most of them civilians. In this context, the people of Gaza have started digging mass graves to bury hundreds of daily victims of the Israeli barbarism. Most of them have been killed by the brutal bombardments so of the Israeli armed forces. There are reports of whole families exterminated and buried under the rubble. There are also reports of a large number of children who have been orphaned and are alone in the UN school and nobody looks for them because they are supposed to have survived the bombings. The situation is extremely critical. Gas is still without water, electricity and food supply.